Welcome to SK Tech. Today I will show you how you can install Kali Linux in your virtual box. So guys, the very first step is to download the Kali Linux ISO image from the official site. So let's follow the instructions. Okay, now open up your browser and type Kali Linux download. Alright, then the first choose kali.org it is the official website and then if you are using a 64 bit operating system then you have to download the 64 bit and for 32 bit operating system you have to download the ISO image that supports 32 bit for Apple M1 chip you have to select this option and download it so in my situation here I'm using 64 bit and then I'm downloading 64 bit here there are two options to download the ISO file so the first one is uh, we can download this from the official direct download and the second option is torrent so if you have torrent then you can download using torrent also so now let's download this from the direct download and it's being downloaded and it will take some time to come ISO image has been downloaded and it is in the desktop so now let's see how we can create a VM so open up your virtual box click on new and then name of the operating system you have to just mention Kali Linux or you can mention anything you want and the type should be Linux and the version should be Debian 64 bit and then select next okay in this option only we have to define the memory size that we are going to allocate for this virtual machine in my case I'm using 16 GB of RAM so I'm just allocating 4 GB out of 16 in here we have to create the virtual hard disk so just leave it default and then select dynamically allocated and for the virtual hard disk I'm just giving 40 GB and then click on create all right the VM setup is now completed so then again go to settings then go to system settings and select processor in my host PC I have eight logical processors so out of 8 I'm just allocating 4 and then click OK. OK now we have completed all the necessary setups in the virtual box. OK now let's begin the installation process. Double click on Kali Linux and then follow the instructions. Select the downloaded image which is in the desktop then click choose in the very first option you can choose graphical install if you are a beginner to Kali Linux and then choose your preferred language and the country you have to select the keyboard layout that you need then you have to provide the host name I'm just leaving as default domain name is not necessary and then you have to type the username full name of the user so in, in my case I'm just giving Kali
re-enter the password and then continue here you have to select the time zone In here leave the default option and continue and then continue and then all files in one partition and then continue select just to allow changes to the hard disk In this option you can choose different desktop environment but I'm just going with default environment Install the bootloader and continue. the installation process is now being successfully completed click on continue now we can start up our Kali virtual machine that we have installed enter your password username and the password Let's verify what is the version that we have installed. So just open up terminal and type the following command which is so already given in the description box. Alright, the version that we have installed is 2021.2. 